Is there an IRS tax lien on your credit report? Let me be very blunt. Nothing ruins credit worse than an IRS tax lien, with the possible exception of a bankruptcy. But there is good news. Let me explain. The presence of a federal tax lien on credit reports has always been a terrible problem for those that are afflicted with it. Anyone that might consider loaning money knows that they will owe in second place to the federal government. They also know that the federal government has tools that other people don't have, that they can intercept tax returns, that they can put liens on your house without going to court first, and they just have all the cards in their favor. Of course they do. Whoever makes the rules is going to make rules that favor them. Well, in their kind-heartedness in recent years, they did come up with something that is really a bit of boon to those that have had problems with them. If you pay what you owe, they will purge the entire record of the matter from your credit reports as long as you ask. If you don't ask, it will just remain there as paid but it will knock your FICO way down and make a terrible impression on a lender. So if you're in a position to pay it off, just simply ask and they will do it. Now, if you're not in a position to pay off the whole thing, there is another provision that they will remove and actually purge the record of the lien from the report if the debt is $25,000 or less and you make an agreement for regular payments to be deducted directly with a debit agreement from your bank account. In that case, it will be taken right off with no record of it, and you will be uh, back in a position of uh, being able to move forward with your credit scoring improvement. Unpaid uh, federal tax liens uh, remain on credit reports indefinitely. They can be there for 20 years. So uh, if they're unpaid, uh, you're going to have to do something about it because it won't just fall off in seven years as most debts do. Uh, there's a special provision for tax that makes them linger and linger, uh, it seems like forever. Uh, when they're paid, if you don't take advantage of the new provisions, they would still show for 10 years that you once had them. And it would be a matter of concern and a matter of a big negative weight on the credit picture. Now, as far as uh, state tax liens are concerned, each individual state has to be dealt with in a different way. The only actual state that I'm aware of, as of the state that, of this uh, broadcast, that does this uh, as a matter of written into law is Utah. But I think that if you have a state tax lien and you talk with your uh, with the people that you're about to make the same kind of a deal that you make with the federal people, that they would probably go along with it. Uh, it must be. Certainly, uh, if the federal people look at it as a matter of good public policy to enable people to purge the records from their federal, uh, from their credit reports, we would think that the state would probably go along with that too. So I think that if you can uh, bring this logic to the uh, tax examiner as you deal with a state tax lien, uh, you could probably make the same sort of deal with them. So there is hope for federal tax liens, but you have to face up to them and have to deal with them head on. But don't forget, if you don't ask, you won't get it.